Hey friends, you are back with the Aries Alchemist for another general tarot reading and I am doing earth signs today. Right now we are on Virgo. And for Virgos, we will be doing mostly just tarot cards. Let's see what's going on for you. I'm already picking up right now that things are kind of slow and steady for you at this point in your life. You got the three of wands in reverse, six of wands in reverse. High Priestess. The world card in reverse. The will of fortune. Let's clarify these. What is the three of wands in reverse, please? What is the six of wands in reverse? What is the high priestess? What is the world in reverse? And what is the will in reverse? Also noted that you have four major arcanas out of ten, so it's definitely some bigger things going on for you. But here with the three of wands clarified by the justice card, both in reverse, I'm seeing that Spirit is really advising you to look more into the future and come up with a plan and not be so much in your head. Start taking the things out of your head and actually getting them onto paper or else you will keep finding situations where you feel like it's just not fair because people with half your talent are making twice as much as you. But it's really because it's all about planning. I'm also seeing right now that you're not getting along with a lot of people because you feel like you should have more help and support than you currently do. But Spirit is saying that this is a journey that you're supposed to go alone. And just because you have already built rapport with somebody doesn't mean that they have to support every single thing that you do. You have to work on your pitch to people and give them a good reason for doing that and supporting you, to be honest. But here with the High Priestess and the Ten of Cups, I'm showing that intuitively you do know what to do. So after you get your plan together, a lot of these people will be on board. They just need to see that you're serious about it. And they need to see that with the world and the, king, the Queen of Wands in Reverse, you're not going to just be taking shortcuts and trying to basically take advantage of them wanting to support you. And then with the Wheel of Fortune and the Page of Pentacles in reverse, I'm seeing that you will get other offers from people that you're not so close to, like that aren't family members or friends that you've known for a while. But just to be mindful, because not every offer is a good offer. Let's go ahead and pull one Oracle card for you. And we're going to do it from the Soul Deck. What else can we tell my Virgo friends to close this out? Virgo, Sun, Moon, and Risings. Keepers of the Earth, you are not alone. Ancient ancestors stand behind you. So this is just your spirit team reminding you that they were behind these messages with you today or for you today. And they are always with you. Those inspired thoughts, those are of their doing too so even when you feel like you don't have the physical support that you need just know that you're not alone 